Both survived still again last week. Holy shit, so that was kind of crazy. Um, I had to cancel some shows because of the snow. Goddamn cancel culture. I don't <laughs> and uh, I posted a photo on Facebook of the snow to let everyone know it was tracked. And holy shit, I've had more civil discussions about gun control on Facebook. Like, people had a fucking meltdown over the snow. Oh, you call that snow? Oh, where I come from, we get 10 inches. I still walk to school uphill both ways. I'm like, fuck you, you're not as good as Four inches is a lot for some places, like your ex wife, okay? We don't, we don't, we don't get a lot of snow. We're not used to it. We, we got three snow plows for the entire city, and one's just a guy named Jim with a truck. I don't think that counts, because he doesn't turn his cell phone on, because he thinks the radiation's nuking his balls. <laughs> Which is fine. I don't want you procreating, but actually I do. We need more snow plows. <laughs> Ooh, you call that snow? It's a lot for us, okay? It would be like if your parents showed you just a little bit of love. It would be overwhelming, you know? But it's not. I will say that, uh, you know, the snow is pretty, but it's, it's uh, dangerous to leave the house, just even to walk across a parking lot. Like, there's no greater fear than, like, uh, there's no more feeling helpless than just, like, about to eat shit on ice, you know? You ever do that one leg thing? Like, my whole life flash before my eyes. But there's no better feeling than actually catching yourself with witnesses. Yeah, I was walking across the parking lot of a gas station, and I started to eat shit, and then I caught myself, and I could tell there was, like, people in a car, like, yes, yeah, yeah, fall, fall, fall. You know? like, Honey, grab the phone, let's make a TikTok, you know? And they're like... But I caught myself and I saw them go, ah, and I was like, hey. <laughs> I was like, that's the best I've ever felt in my life. <laughs>